Hey, what up YouTube? Vivex here, and I, I'm sorry, I haven't been posting in a while, but, um, I decided this was post-worthy. Um, this is the new, um, Epic Dawn, uh, sealed pack battle kit. And so, um, for those of you who already know, great, for those of you that don't, I will explain. Um, the new, uh, battle pack thing is supposed to be a new type of gameplay for the game. And supposedly you buy a certain number of packs and you make a deck from what you get in the packs. And so they were printed a lot of good cards, specifically Tour Guide. And so that's what I'm going to be hoping to pull today. And in the battle kit, you also get a mat. So I'm going to open that up for you guys. And, and then we'll see if I get one. I'll try to keep the pack openings in view. Hopefully better than uh, my opening of it. Alright, and so just so you guys know, the trash can's right behind me, so. Is there a nicer way to open this? Ugh, there was. Oh well. Let's just take all the packs and stuff out of here. Alright, and then you get a mat. Let's see if I can show you guys that. It's another one of the small ones. So you guys can see this. Yeah. I like the the design on it. I just wish it were bigger, like a normal mat size, but of course not. It's in like a little tiny thing. And here are the small little packs. They have, so each pack has five cards in it, one star foil, a rare, and then three commons. And the star foil is supposed to look like a DT kind of, so that's what to expect. All right. Alright, cool. Book of Moon is the Starfoil and Gem Knight Pearl. I believe that is the rare. And these are the three commons I got. Um, this is actually the second card I was hoping to get because um, this isn't in any other set and it's like a beat stick for rank fours, which is great. Um, and then uh, if you guys can see the Starfoil on that, it, it does look similar to DT, but they have little stars on them instead. Uh, Alright, let's put it over here. Okay. Uh, premature Burial is the Star Foil, and Scapegoat is the Rare. These are the three commons. Um, I'm, I, don't, I didn't look too much into the gameplay, but I believe uh, Premature Burial is banned, and so I'm wondering if there's a different ban list for the new game style. Alright. Also, they were printed Fabled Raven, so that's good. I got a Divine Wrath for the Starfoil, and then Wind Up Zen Meister for the um, Rare. No Tour Guide yet. Oh, they also were printed Pot of Duality, again, I believe. So, that's another thing to look forward to. Alright, Oblos the Tormentor is my Starfoil, and United We Stand is the rare. Right. Back openings are usually short, I believe. Okay. Grave Squirmer is the star foil, and Utopia is the rare. Those are the commons. Alright, I believe that's four down. Four or five, yeah. Not really counting. Just opening these. Alright. Power Giant is the Star Foil and another Gemini Pearl. Cool. That's the rare. Uh oh. I think that's uh, four packs left and no tour guide. Ooh, sadness. Come on. One tour guide. Ooh, that's nice. Yep. Alright. Zephyrus the Elite. I actually like that common. Uh, ooh, Starfall Pot of Duality. Um, and Gronosaurus is the rare. And there we go, Phoenix Chain. I'm going to put that aside just because that's another good reprinted common. I like Zephyrus. So yeah, they reprinted a lot of good stuff, and I'm actually happy about that. It'll definitely make the new gameplay easier. Alright. Luster Dragon is the Starfoil, and Soul Exchange is the rare. Alright. 
Gronosaurus is the Starfoil, and Leviathan Dragon is the Rare. Alright, last pack. Still no tour guide. This is it. Alright, here we go. Morphing Jar, another good reprint. Uh, Graceful Charity is the Starfoil, and Swords Reveal and is the Rare. No tour guide. Sadness. Well, I'll do a quick little review of what I got. Um, just for the people who didn't want to watch the full video. Uh, for rares, we got Swords, Soul Exchange, United We Stand, Scapegoats. These are the four spells I got in rare. And then for Xyz, I got Gronosaurus, Leviathan Dragon, Zen Meister, one Utopia, and two Gem Knight Pearl. Alright, those are all the rares. And for the Starfoil, I got Graceful Charity. I got, uh, Book of Moon. I got Premature Burial. And Pod Duality. This is the best Starfoil that I got out of this little opening. For Traps, I just got one Divine Wrath. For... Monsters, I got Luster Dragon. I don't know how to pronounce that. Gilosaurus, I think. Uh, Grave Squirmer. Power Giant. And Ombolus the Tormentor. And then I got a assortment of commons, but by far the best are Fiend's Chain, Zephyrus the Elite, and Morphing Jar. Uh, those are, I believe, the best commons that I pulled. There's also a... Uh, Fabled Raven reprint in there. Um, and so look out for that. That's going to be great. So I will see you guys next time. Um, if I get any more Epic Dawn, I'll be sure to open it on camera. Maybe I'll get lucky and pull a tour guide then. But I'm not too um, unhappy with the results. So I believe the, the standard pull is one tour guide per box. So I think buying um, just random packs like this is more effective. Um... But yeah, until next time, I'll try to update videos more often. Um, I'll give you maybe a profile, I think, maybe by Friday of um, my Piper Countdown deck, which, after the video, is going to be going on eBay, because I'm going to make Insectors, and so um, I'll do that. But until next time, guys.